The second question was, how do I continue to sell 100 properties a year every year? Okay, so I'm not going to tell you guys how exactly how I structure my day because I'm a coach, a social media guy, I own several businesses, I'm all over the place, right? You, you guys don't have the same life, travel, speak, so on and so forth. But I'll give you the secret formula. You want the secret formula? Okay, here we go. <laughs> You want the secret formula? Yeah. Okay, here we go. 100 deals a year. It's, it's simple math, okay? How many people here, how many of you would like to just close one a week? Okay, okay, two a week. Okay, okay, two a week is 100 a year, okay? 52 weeks minus Christmas and Thanksgiving and whatever kind of holidays you guys do. It's very simple math. Here's the problem. You guys don't know the benchmarks. If you were to ask any random agent, okay, how many active buyers and sellers are you working with right now? The most common answer is four. Now you're probably thinking in your head, oh crap, that's all I'm working with. Or I only have two, or I only have six. Statistically speaking, four active buyers and sellers is 0.8 deals. You know what that equals? Zero. You don't have any business going on if you're working with four active buyers and sellers. Benchmarks. So you get four active buyers and sellers and you work four buyer, active buyers and sellers. And that's as far as you take it. You're just putting all your eggs in this basket. Chances are, look, maybe you closed two of them. Okay, you got lucky. Statistically speaking, it's nothing. Now what do we got to do? What are the benchmarks that we need to hit to hit the goals that we want? It's simple math. If you want to close one a week, you need to have 15 to 20 active buyers and sellers at all times. That will yield you one closing a week. It's real simple math. Here's the technicality behind it. Here's the details. You create a separate list outside of your database. You got your database, you're doing your marketing, you're doing your weekly email, you're doing all of the stuff that you do to stay in touch with your sphere. But you got this separate list. I always use the Google Sheet. You can use whatever you want. When someone tells you that they're thinking about doing something in the next two, three, four months or so, they're gonna go on this list. You wanna build this list up. You know, they're telling you they might use you as an agent or they're not working with an agent, okay? You wanna build this list up. On this list, you're gonna make notes every time that you have a communication with this prospect. Okay, and you're gonna know where you are in every situation. Every day when you wake up, part of your routine needs to be to look through this list and see if there's anybody there you need to do something to, to push that situation forward just a little bit. Now here's where agents lose it. If someone ghosts you, if someone moves forward with you, lists their property, or go under contract as a buyer, if someone says, ah, we changed our mind, we're, we're gonna hold off for now, or if they list their property or move forward with a different agent, right? Any of those circumstances takes them off this list. Now what? You had 15, you had to keep it between 15 and 20 to close one a week, but now you're 14. Uh-oh. You better get one to replace because you better keep it between 15 and 20. Now, th now the reason why I say hey, this is where agents lose it is because they don't keep track and they don't take people off the list when they need to take them off. They're not actively working that list the way that they should be. If you actively work that list the way that you should, and you've always got a legitimate 15 to 20 prospects that you're working, uh, active buyers and sellers that are looking to possibly do something with you soon, you will close one property a week. You will. Simple math. If you want to do two a week, you got to have 25 plus. You just got to keep it above 25. That's what I did for years and years and years and years. And I sold 100 properties a year. This isn't like, maybe this works, or I read this somewhere, or another guy told me this. This is what I did. There's the secret formula right there.